Well, our taste of the Ozarks is a summertime treat that will melt in your mouth. Once again, here is Chef Nicole Young bringing happiness to your dinner table. Hey everyone, welcome back to Taste of the Ozarks. Blueberry season hit early in our garden this year and we couldn't be more excited. We are gonna make a lemon blueberry gooey butter cake and this might just become one of your new favorite desserts. It is so simple and absolutely delicious. So let's go ahead and get started. We're starting with just a lemon cake base and you're gonna go ahead and make this with just the oil and the eggs that are in the directions to start. And we are gonna take half of our mixture and put it down in a nine by 13 pan. You wanna make sure that you spray your pan really well. And then we'll just scoop half of this down in there. And then we wanna get half of this mashed out. But in order to do that, we are gonna to need to spray our rubber spatula really well so that it does not stick to all of the cake batter that's in there and it can actually spread it out for us. So we're gonna give that a nice spray. And then you can see it's allowing us to just give it a little bit of a spread. You are just looking for a very thin layer across the bottom here. And we just barely want it to cover the bottom of the cake pan because this is gonna become basically the crust of our gooey butter cake. And you may need to spray it again a couple of times just to keep it from sticking and to allow it to spread out really well. And then once we've gotten that part done, we are gonna take the other half of our batter and we're gonna mix in the rest of our ingredients that are gonna make this nice and gooey. So we've got our powdered sugar. We're gonna go ahead and put all of that in there. Once we've got that in, we're gonna add our fresh lemon juice. I'm gonna take my lemon here and roll it back and forth just to break up all those juice cells that are in there. Cut it in half and use our citrus reamer so we don't end up with any seeds down in there. You can use uh, lemon juice that's in a bottle if you want to. I always prefer fresh lemon juice. I don't know why, but I feel like you get more of that lemon flavor from fresh lemon juice. Maybe it's just me. And then we're gonna kinda just give this a little bit of a stir so that when we use our hand mixer, that powdered sugar doesn't just fly all over the place. It's also gonna help that lemon juice to incorporate with that powdered sugar and start melt it, melting it just a little bit. So once we've got that in there, we are gonna go ahead and take our hand mixer just give this a quick beat. Once that powdered sugar's in, we are gonna take our eight ounces of cream cheese and mix this in too. It's super important that your cream cheese is softened, so let it sit out on the counter for at least an hour. We are gonna whip this all together. And then once that is whipped all together, I'm gonna get all that batter out of those beaters there. And then we are gonna take our fresh blueberries and we are gonna fold them right into this. And this batter is thick enough that it will suspend these fresh blueberries and they shouldn't sink to the bottom like they would in a normal thinner cake batter. Go ahead and get that all mashed in. You wanna make sure that these are kind of evenly distributed. And when the blueberries bake, they're gonna release some of their juice which will thin down this part just a little bit. So we'll go ahead and put this right over the top of our crust. If you want it to be a little gooier, you could add just a little bit of water to your batter, but at this point, it's gonna come out about the consistency of cheesecake on the top with that crust on the bottom. And we just wanna get this spread mostly to the edges. We're gonna put this in a 350 degree oven and with the eggs that were in our package directions, it's gonna puff up nicely and everything's kinda gonna spread out to the edges. Now just know that your edges will come out taller than your middle will, which is totally fine. And then we're just gonna go ahead and put this entire thing in a preheated 350 degree oven. You want it to be golden brown around the edges. It is gonna be still just a little bit jiggly on the inside when it comes out. And your finished product comes out looking like this. So these are some of the edges. They're a little bit taller. And this is kind of the center. And it's like a soft, creamy, delicious cheesecake. It's got that tart lemon, those fresh blueberries in there. It is a perfect summer dessert. If you go to a blueberry patch to pick or you've got them in your own house, this is an awesome, awesome way to use up those delicious blueberries. Super yummy. Tastes just like summer. Give it a try. We'll see you guys next time.